Jeff from Two Hacks Garage. Well, we're back on Project Fastback Flyer, that 1968 Ford Torino GT Fastback. 351 powered Windsor engine with a four speed top loader transmission. As you see in these videos, we just been kind of, I wouldn't say winging it, but we're just kind of going with the flow. We got a whole bunch of parts from Holly, got a whole bunch of parts from some other places. And we really, we just been putting this thing back together to make it a really nice fun cruiser. Um, we have been getting slowed down by what I've always called as the little things. But you just got to plow through that. You got to stay positive. You got to have a plan B. And it's always good to have your friends with you helping you out. Another set of eyes, another set of ears. All that brainstorming really does come in handy. But if you notice in other videos with those small things, always looking stuff up, trying to find stuff out, brackets, you know, how stuff goes back together because we didn't take this car apart. And, you know, I have another Ford, but I don't know a whole lot about these cars. So what I did was I scrounged through all my stuff, found one of my Chilton manuals here. And I also found, well, here's a handy dandy one. It is actually a factory Ford 1968 Ford Mercury shop manual. This is an original one. It's going to come in handy. It's literally got everything, diagrams, torque specs, exploded views. You know what? This is something that looks like NASA would have written. So with that, guys, what we're going to do tonight is we're going to tackle a whole bunch of the more small things on this. See if we can't make a whole bunch more headway. But here in a little bit, when we get in the air, I'm going to show you something where we're going to be kind of having to do some modification to one of the headers. It's going to be one of those plan B type things. We're going to make it work. It's going to look good and it's going to perform just as great. With that, guys, we'll see you in a little bit. It's time for to work on Project Fast Pass Flyer. I just heard Kenny pulled up. Yep, saw Eddie pull up. Kyle's here. We better get rocking and rolling. See you soon. So this is what we're fighting here. Um, basically what we got going on here is this header right here on the passenger side or driver side is tight. Our Z bar and everything, if I can get up in here, is really hitting on there. And if you look here, it is actually in line with the cross member. Now mind you, this is made for this car. However, all these applications are kind of funky, but so our plan is, is we actually got to drop these tubes, cut this, move it, and get it to kind of come back in here. So that's what we're going to actually work on and see what happens later.
All right. Well, tonight was another night of lessons learned. Um, what we figured out was the driver side header was going to work just fine, or passenger side header was going to work just fine, but the driver side wasn't. We tried bending it, heating it. You guys all know how that goes when you're dampling bending headers, it, especially with a body Mopars. It'll always do that. But we found out on this Ford what we wanted to do or not, so we ended up putting the original stock factory manifolds back on it and now we're coming up with a game plan to get the exhaust built um, we do have the original pipes for this so we can use it as a template um, one other thing we did get done a couple things up top more of the small things got the rest of the clutch hooked up so that's a good thing but like i said we're not four torino experts we didn't take this car apart i'm not saying that's an excuse but we're learning as we go and the shop manuals did come in handy so that's a positive so with that, guys, we'll see you on the next episode of Project Fastback Flyer. These guys are making noise.